me, Superstar Dolph Ziggler, and you're watching Brett O Live. What is going on, guys? Brett O Live back with another video, and today, as you guys can see, it is Money in the Bank 2020 pre- Predictions. Look Woo! at this. It's got prediction time. This baby. Yeah, this is gonna be absolutely amazing. Got my Money in the Bank T-shirt on right here. We got Dad alive. Dad was here. As well as NFL fan ah, talk show. And you guys show. are probably like, wait, why are they guys both together? Don't worry, guys. It's just a soap soap yep. opera over there for all those other videos. But yes, guys, predictions. And this Money in the Bank is not like any other. It is gonna take place inside. And Inside. on the and Inside. on the top of WWE headquarters in Connecticut, I think I said. But yes, this is going to be absolutely awesome. One of the most interesting pay-per-views of all time, in my opinion. Oh, it's it's absolutely crazy. But yes, guys, without further ado, we are going to get into our predictions with WWE X figures. You're going to get all three of our opinions. So without further ado, yep. let's do yes. it. For the first match, it is Tamina versus Bailey Tamina. for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Surprising. Ba Bailey versus Tamina for the SmackDown Women's Championship. Wow. Uh, Sasha Banks could be looming on ringside, but you never know. So, yeah. Dad, would you like to go first? Uh, yeah, I think that uh, Bailey's still going to take it, but what's going to end up happening is at Money in the Bank, Sasha is going to turn on Bailey finally. That, they've I think always been teasing happen. that. So I think that Bailey will win over Tamina, and then uh, Sasha Banks is going to turn on Bailey finally because cool. it's been way too friends way too long. Yeah, ever since WrestleMania, it's been going down like that. What do you think, Brian? I kind of agree with Dad Alive. I think Bailey's going to win, same thing. Sasha Banks is going to trade on her because, you know, they've been a long time. And Sasha Sick. Banks, she's tired of not having a title probably, so she just wants the title probably really bad. But yeah, they've been teasing Sasha Banks turning on Bailey for such a long time and Sasha Banks got uh like like I don't know like Bailey made or not made but she kind of like accidentally made Sasha Banks lose against Tamina on Smackdown a couple weeks ago so I think Bailey is going to lose and I think Tamina is going to pick up the title no wait change my oh. prediction Bailey's oh. going to win the title oh yeah who on that yeah. sorry Bailey's it's winning Bailey's I don't know what I was thinking for win. a sec into the next match, we have Drew McIntyre versus the Monday Night Messiah, Seth Rollins, for the WWE Championship. And Buddy Murphy will probably be looming on ringside. Dad, what do you think? I'm going Drew McIntyre to retain because he's only had it for be. about six weeks. And uh, I am this time, as all of you know, I never Paul bet would against do. my band, man, Seth Rollins. But this time, I have to bet against Seth freaking Rollins. Yes, and, Brian. And please get rid of the Money at Messiah. No! Yeah, I do not like it. Dad, well, Brian, what do you think? I go, uh, Drew McIntyre will win. Um, cut, yeah, same thing. The Money at Messiah, Seth Rollins, horrible. Seth Rollins has to be by himself if, he, if he's a heel. For the WWE Championship, in the end, I think Drew McIntyre will probably retain. He literally just won at WrestleMania. There's no way they take it away from him this early, but it would be pretty cool to see it on Seth Rollins. Hopefully he get in the future. But yes, I'm going with Drew McIntyre. I think you guys said Drew McIntyre too, right? Yeah, it's a three-way tag. Yeah, I'm thinking so. For the next match, we have a four-way tag team match for the SmackDown Ooh. Tag Ooh. Team Championships. It is Lince Dorado and Grand Metalik, the Lucha House Party, versus Miz and Moira's son. And the New Day, as well as the Forgotten Sons from NXT. You got Wesley Blake as well as uh, Jackson Riker and Steve Cutler. So, Dad, what do you think? There's a four-way tag team match for the SmackDown Tag Titles, and the New Day currently hold them. I am going Miz and Morris. Yes! That's this. why I think it's going I'd to like win. I've seen the Luchas uh, possibly do yeah. it. I think it would actually be kind of cool if they did. <laughs> Crap. But, uh, yeah, I don't think Mr. McMahon's going to allow that. So, I'm thinking I'm going uh, yeah. Miz Morrison. That's New Day's that's done it way too many times. Mm -hmm. And uh, Mr. Morrison, it's their time to yeah. shine. Yeah, well, Brian? No. Well, knowing Vince McMahon, he would probably make the guys from NXT win. It's <laughs> like push them. Lucha House Party's not going to win. It's between Miz and Morrison and Kofi Kingston. Oh, Ellen. And don't forget about the Forgotten Sons. I mean, I, I Jackson Riker, Steve Cutler, Wesley no. Blake. I'm going to go Miz and Morrison probably. I am also going with Miz and Morrison. Ooh. The New Day, I think they're just trying to give the New Day the titles because, like, okay, we got to get their title numbers up. They're eight-time tag champs right now. But yeah, I love Miz and Morrison as tag champs. They need them back, hopefully. And I think we all said Miz and Morrison. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. All right, let's move them over there. For the, for the next match, before we get into the Money in the Bank matches, Ooh. it is the Monster Amongst Men, Braun Strowman versus Bray Wyatt, the Fiend, for the SmackDown uh, Universal Championship. Dad, what do you think? And Braun Strowman obviously curr currently holds it. Oh, man, you know what? I'd I know, I'd like right? To say, I'd like to say... The, um, the Fiend? The, no, I'd like Braun to Strowman? say Braun Strowman to retain. Oh my God. 
But oh. I, I have a feeling it's going to be the Fiend for the Universal yeah, Championship. Feeling, but I mean, former brothers. I mean, you know what I mean. The Black Sheep. And, yeah, and they also and mentioned it. And Dead always other. says, "Oh, they never mentioned the history. They did yeah, this time, which did. is weird." So I'm going. I'm going to go the Fiend on this one. I think. I, I don't know if I'm right, but I'm going Fiend. All right. I'm going to have to go with the Fiend, but I think all this talking is going to change Braun Strowman. Ooh. I think Braun Strowman is going. He's going to let him in. Yeah, and he's going to go with the Fiend and be like his partner. No. I, I, I <laughs> could happen. Cool. Could happen. Could like happen. changing him. He's like, like messing with him. Messing with his brain. That's what the Fiend does. Yeah. Uh, in the end, I think the Fiend will probably pick up the Ooh. Universal Championship. Uh, well, I don't know, though. Oh, man. I'm going to say the Fiend in the end. I don't really have an uh, explanation for it, but I'm just going to say the Fiend. All right. Okay, Moving another, into the... Another three-way tie. Crazy. Wow. Moving into the uh, men's and women's Money in the Bank ladder matches, which, you guys won't believe me on this, are happening at the same exact time. Wow, I have no idea cool. what is going to happen with this. I don't know how they're going to film this. It's going to be absolutely insane. But for the women's Money in the Bank match, it is Shayna Baszler, Nia Jax, Carmella, Asuka, Dana Brooke, as well as Lacey Evans. Dad, in the end, who do you think is going to win the women's Money in the Bank briefcase? Again, it's happening on the top of a roof, starting on the floor of headquarters to the roof. I am going to go with my girl, Lacey Evans. Ooh. Because she was kind of cheated on the uh, at WrestleMania, yeah, 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 and I did not like that. So I think she deserves it. She's Man. she's actually one of the over best here on wrestlers, SmackDown, in my opinion, out of all of them. She's really there. good. She, she, That's she's Shayna Baszler. Really good, but uh, not a huge fan of Shayna. But I mean, it's all good too. Yeah. But uh, I'm going. Uh, yeah, Lacey Evans to uh, to to take it on this one. Dang. All right. All right. Um, some of you guys might think my prediction is gonna be a little stupid. All right. But I'm gonna go with. <laughs> The girl, the girl that Brett hates the most. Dana? Yeah. No, you're going with Dana Brooke. Say, tell him. I'm gonna go with Dana Brooke. Oh my God. Why would they put her in this match? I hate her. She is horrible. Wow. She is horrible. Why would they put um, her in this match? Yeah, but in the end, I honestly think that Lacey Evans is gonna take this. I think she needs it. She hasn't really been getting too much, and she, again, like Dad said, is like gotta be like the most. Athletic wrestler in this match. I think she's the best. Even over Asuka, I think Lacey Evans is better. That's just my opinion. Lacey Evans, Lacey Evans, and Dana, Dana Brooke. Brooke. Crazy. Dana Brooke. Wow. Into the men's oh, man. Money in the Bank match. The phenomenal one. A. And our final J. match. Yes. Styles. Daniel Bryan. King. Corbin. Rey Mysterio. Alistair. Black is also in this huh. match, as uh, well as Otis. Otis is in this match. Can you believe it? He beat Dolph Ziggler to qualify. But yes, Dad, what do you think? I am gonna go with something, someone that I don't think people would predict. Otis? I, no. Okay. I, I am going with King Corbin. I am. <laughs> I just don't think that the storyline's over with this knucklehead yet. I love so him. I He's awesome. That, I think that the King Corbin is going to take it. It's Although good. you'd think it would be AJ or, or Daniel, Daniel Bryan. Bryan. That's yeah. I'm, I'm between going them. Corbin on this. <laughs> I, I just think that He's everybody won it before. loves him being it's a crazy. heel. And uh, why not? Yeah. Well, I'm. <laughs> Otis, I don't think he's yeah, got a chance. He's yeah. probably just going to get beat up. And yeah, like, I don't know about like Otis. I think he needs to continue driving I don't driving think Otis or Dana Bryan is going to win. I think it's going to be between King Corbin, Ray Mysterio, and Alistair Black. <laughs> My final really? prediction what? is going to be... Alistair what? Black. Wow. Oh, my God. Okay. Alistair uh, Black. My TV. prediction is going to be no Alistair Black. I don't think Rey Mysterio is going to win. It would it's, be cool, Rey Mysterio. It though. would he be. He never wins. But he never wins anything. No. It's between King Corbin, Daniel Bryan, and AJ Styles, at least for me. Uh, at least for me. But yes, in the end. Oh, man. I put the briefcase on Daniel Bryan before we started this video. Oh, man. I'm going to go with... The phenomenal AJ Styles. He's never going to bet against Styles. <laughs> Everybody knows So that. we'll throw our picks. Dead, King Corbin, I'm Alistair Black, Corbin. as well as AJ Styles. Okay, guys, that was the Money in the Bank prediction video. Let me know your predictions, mainly for the ladder matches down in the comments down below. Again, for the men's, he said... 
King Corbin, Corbin. and then Brian said Alistair Black, and then I said the Phenomenal Age of Styles. But yes, yep. guys, again, let me know your predictions in the comments below. Follow me on Instagram at Brutal Duty Figures. Follow Brian on uh, YouTube. NFL Talk Show. Yes. Thank you, Dad Alive, for being in this video. And Always. Again, this has been Brutal Live. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Check out all the new videos on the channel as well, and I'll see you guys next time. Brutal Live. Out. And yes. remember, if you don't like WWE, <laughs> we don't like you. <laughs> Man. <laughs>